Hey y'all, hey! I'm back with another unboxing of Archer and Olive's subscription box. And I really, really like this one. Um, there are some things here that I wasn't excited about, but <laughs> I'm going to take you through this box uh, with me. So first you're looking at this pouch or pin case that came with this kit. It is double-sided. I do like this because I of course hoard a lot of pins like everyone else here <laughs> this weekly calendar sticker roll i am excited about because this is an easy way for me to add notes or calendar bits um, without drawing or sketching an entire calendar out i will say that i wish that it started on monday because that's how i prefer to start my week in my planners but i can adjust <laughs> and i'm still excited about this sticker roll there's about five or six boxes, different boxes before they repeat. And then the next thing you'll see are the three journals. The first one is a blackout book. They are very small. Um, the next one is a craft paper journal. And the last one, of course, is the um, regular dot grid journal. And so one of these <laughs> I've already promised to a friend. So I'm not going to open that one but I'm gonna open the ones that I plan to keep. And so the first one is the regular white paper dot grid notebook. And so I'm excited about it because you saw it fits like right in the palm of my hand. This is really cute, small and easy to carry around. And I'm not 100% sure yet what I'm gonna use it for, but I am so intentional about using it for something. <laughs> So I think um, this is the one that I'm not going to open. I'm sending it to a planner friend. And then the last one is the blackout book, which I also plan to keep, but I have no idea at the moment what I'm going to use it for. And just so you know, this does have um, ultra thick paper, dot grid pages in all of them. And I'm not quite sure of the exact size. Um, I'll look that up. And then if anyone needs to know, I can put that in the caption of this video. I would call it pocket size. The next thing I'm opening are the um, calligraphy brush pens from Archer and Olive. I wasn't sure what to expect. So <laughs> I was happily su um, surprised by the guides which i think will be very helpful for people who are starting i probably won't use these <laughs> but um i am excited that they're available and the um marker is dual tipped there is a wide brush in and then a, a narrow brush tip in now i didn't discover that the other side was brush tip until i started writing on this piece of paper from the packaging <laughs> so i started with a narrow tip on this one and then I realized when I pressed down, I said, oh, this is a brush pen too. <laughs> and so um, I wrote with both sides. I will say um, I was a little confused. The top looks a little gray and the bottom looks like a, like a light tan, but they came from the same pen. So I think I need to read <laughs> the maybe the box or the pen colors and see if the colors are slightly different on both ends. Um, also, I am actually um, happy with the way they write. So some brush pens, like they're not as stable and these are very stable. So I'm looking forward to writing with these. My favorites, uh, I'm gonna show you in a moment, are the more bold colors and the lighter colors of course could be used for shadowing or drawing and even writing, but um, I prefer the ink colors that I use in my journal and to be dark. So these three colors that I'm picking up right now are my three favorites. So you'll see me <laughs> pull those out and separate them just for the sake of the video. And then the next thing I'm gonna open are these small pockets, adhesive pockets. So there's adhesive on the back for you to attach them to something. Um, I like the colors in that they have this gold foiling on them in these geometric patterns. I was hoping that they would fit inside of the small journals, but unfortunately they are just about the same size and wouldn't work well inside of them. 
This is a sticker book that has three different sets of stickers with two pages of each set. And so these would be great for creating your own calendar or decorating a monthly spread or a weekly spread. And they have some of the same pattern shapes and colors that are featured in the markers and the pouch, so on and so forth. This is a card that can be sent to a friend um, or you could keep. It um, says I have the power to create change and it's um, blank on the back. I really do like the Archer and Olive sticker seal that looks like a wax seal. And these are coloring pages. I love the packaging of the coloring pages. I just think it's unique. Um, thinking about using that for Happy Mail somehow. <laughs> Um, I will admit I, I'm not excited about the coloring pages because I'm, I'm not really a colorer, so to speak. Um, I color images that I draw and things like that, but not like just coloring pages. So I might give this to a friend, which is fine. You know, um, sometimes we might not like everything we receive in a box, but there are some people out there who may love these sheets. And I think that it's amazing that they can cater to the needs and interests of so many different people. So I'm going to spread all this out again. I do not have a coupon code for this brand. I am not trying to convince you to subscribe, <laughs> but I did want to share with you what I receive as I do often on my channel. If you're interested in connecting with me, all of my social information is in the caption of this video. Also, um, I am planning to use these items. So if you're curious as to how I'll use them, Follow my journey on Instagram at Confident Canvas.